in the last six months, we were passed through a roller coaster of emotions. We fought the battle of our lives. We managed to control the virus with containment. It is a collective effort that has enabled us to limit the spread of this dangerous virus. Everyone has put their own to it. We're now a lot better equipped than in March. We have stocks of masks and gear for at least a month of reserve. 14,000 tests are done per day and investigations are carried out quickly. And in 15 days, 8,000 new attendants will finish their training and will come as reinforcement to be had to the staff of our CHSLD. But the virus is still lurking all over Quebec. We absolutely must prevent it from rising again. So I need all Quebecers. We have to put ourselves together. I ask you to continue to keep your distance, to wash your hands, and to wear a mask in closed places. And I ask you to avo avoid private gathering of more than 10 people. The next few weeks will be critical with the reopening of schools, with the return to work, with the fact that we'll be more uh, indoors, we have to find our discipline. We need to get back to the discipline we had in the spring. We don't want to go back to confinement. We don't want our hospitals to be overcrowded and to have to postpone surgeries. We don't want to close our businesses. And above all, we don't want to close our schools. So we hold that to our children. So please be careful. Thank Usually you. when you gentlemen sit there and tell us there's been increases, uh, you say uh, it's usually been based in Montreal. Um, now you're saying it's more spread out in many different regions. Can, can you give us a, a better explanation of, of the increases over the last, uh, last two weeks, a little more specifics on where and how are, how are people getting sick? Yeah, well, we've seen a diversity in, in uh, at least five or six regions. And uh, we, you, you remember we, we had Montreal and a bit of Laval, Montérégie. But now we have La Naudière, we have um, Laurentide, we have Montérégie. Uh, and so it's, it's getting farther with, uh, it's really small outbreaks of uh, 10, 15 persons uh, that go in different places. It could be uh, physical activities uh, uh, with younger persons. Uh, we've given the example of karaoke uh, in, in Quebec City. Uh, so there, there's been many of those outbreaks. There, there's some that are work-related in, in some areas. Uh, and very often, it's one person that doesn't know that uh, he or she is infected and, and goes with the others. Sometimes it's really taking less care of what's happening. People that kind of, as we have said, uh, lift their, their uh, protective procedure and, and, and feel that there's no risk with the others. And then we've seen many contacts. And, and very often, people may get sick, so we have cases, but then you have people that are contacts that need to end are losing some school or some work and, and so on. So that's what we've seen. See, it's small outbreaks that are in many different regions.